<laughs> well, you, don't you come anywhere near me with those things. <laughs> we had to stop off to get some fuel. That's why Mrs. Beard had the, uh, the cavity search gloves on there. <laughs> Today we're going to um, a place called March, by which I don't mean I've mastered time travel. The, the actual area is called March. Imagine if you could go back to uh, March 2020 though, better times. We uh, we ready to resume our journey, darling? Yes. Cool. We're doing a food challenge, by the way. I, I, that's probably obvious, right? Just move my little bag of treats. <laughs> Darling, a little bit of flavour on there. What's wrong with you? Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna move the Sunday out of the way just uh, just for now. <laughs> yeah, whenever you say go. Okay. Oh, how long do you uh, do you get to finish? Forty-five minutes. Okay. <laughs> What's up, Ben? Welcome back to another video. And oh, man, that was a, a positively shambolic start <laughs> to the episode. I forgot my catchphrase, so who's gonna? For the people to get upset when I when I forget. Uh, but more crucially, I forgot to actually introduce the food challenge we're doing today. So uh, to that effect, we're at a place called Shooters American Diner in March, which I think is just slightly east of Northampton. Uh. Although that, that could be wrong. Geography is not really one of my strong areas of academia. <laughs> and we're taking on their uh, as yet undefeated food challenge, which consists of one chili hot dog, one rather large burger, some fries, a sundae, and as you can see, a pizza. I'm gonna make a gourmet chip sandwich. All right, chip butty. I'm not eating that just yet though. Did I even say where we were? <laughs> I don't think I introduced the place. It's called Shooters American Diner and it's in March. I don't know what I should do. The, the chili will be sloppy so I'll do the pizza because when the pizza gets cold it'll be hard. Always thinking though, I'd always think. Yeah, thinking so hard I actually forgot to, to introduce the, the, the video. <laughs> anyway, anyway let's, let's not dwell on mistakes. Could I get another glass of water? <clears throat> Oh, plenty of, time. Wow. <laughs> plenty of time, said Mrs. Beard. Yeah, we, we started this pretty well. 45 minutes is the limit. Normally, I would leave the crust into the end, but I've learned my lesson. That, that's burned me too many times. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I thought yeah, for a change, I would be efficient and get in, get into those crusts while they were nice and, and warm and, and, you know, malleable. That's a good word. <laughs> Yeah, as you can see, not, not quite as malleable as I would have liked, but um, it wasn't half bad. A little burnt on the edges, but I don't mind that in a pizza. And actually, the pizza was probably my favorite part of this. It was nice and cheesy. Liked it. Look at the size of this, man. Reminds me of a Sonic the Hedgehog chili dogs. Yeah, I was really more of a Nintendo guy when I was a kid, but I think that's right. Sonic and chili dogs. Spicy. <clears throat> oh yeah, this thing had more kick to it than Roy Keane. It was, um, it was a surprise package. It's definitely spicier than I, I anticipated. Had a little pulled pork in there as well, so it was, it was a little fruity, but mostly hot. Napkin, the woman. <laughs> Is that a used napkin? Yes. It'll have to do, but you know, if the waitress comes by, no, all right, all right. Did I hear you say you had a fork? No, it's spicy. Yeah, yeah, it is spicy. We get it. Quit banging on about it. Anyway, if, if you finish this inside 45 minutes, not only is the meal free, you get a t-shirt too. It's been a while since I got one of those. I ain't licking no plate. 
is the oddest looking coleslaw I've ever seen. It looks like it has frog spawn in there or something. I'm sure it doesn't. <coughs> yeah, let's get, the, let's get the plate out of the way. Oh, some more chips now. And it always the way. Always with the chips. Although, to be fair, there were already like two regular sized portions here. And there's a lot of variety in this um, in terms of flavor, so far be it for me to complain, right? No! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least you've already eaten, right? Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, those uh, socially distanced spectators. I couldn't put them off their main course because I'd already eaten, but I didn't see them eating dessert, so that could be on me. I mean, it's not going to taste great, but it's it, it's it's going to make it moist. Is um, has anyone done this before? Has anyone finished this before? No. We've had. I think you have to try it. No. Oh. I don't know, I don't know. It's actually alright. Yeah, how about that? Add a little bit of herby coleslaw to your chip butter and you got some serious luxury nouveau cuisine. Who knew? <laughs> yeah, of course, no worries. Alright, you know what? If there's one thing, <laughs> don't do this when you when you're back at school and you're in the canteen. Don't don't try and. It's quite a thick Sunday. I was hoping it'd be like milkshake. There's like a full banana in this. <laughs> one of your five a day, son. Pipe down. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, I'll catch you in the next one. I'm kind of regretting going for the banana now. I could have something more fun like Oreo or. I suppose this is technically the healthy option. Uh. Do you want to check under the table? I bet you think I've been cheating, don't you? I'm seeing where it's going. You still have 22 minutes. Yeah, no, it's. I thought I'd take it easy today. <laughs> I'll let you it's it's been, look at that. It's a collector's item. I like that t-shirt. Look at that one. That's the real deal. It smells fresh too. A lot of these sometimes they keep them in the back next to the, the fryers. <laughs> they smell terrible, but this smells... Uh, I'm getting a scent of um, like Lenore or something. Breaking up is hard to do. Neil Sedaka, you can't beat this. 50s was great. <laughs> this is before you had songs like WAP. 